Hey guys, Casey Ferris here. Today we're taking a look at the ATEM Mini. It's a four channel HDMI switcher as well as an HDMI interface. That means you can use up to four HDMI cameras, game systems, PCs, pretty much anything that takes HDMI and switch them live all into one USB input and it will show up on your system as a webcam. Super powerful. This is a really slick way to do multi-camera live streams, or even just free up some processing power on your system. We'll take a look really quickly at setting up two different kinds of streams today. But the first thing you wanna do is download and install the ATEM software from the Blackmagic website and make sure the switcher is updated. Then you wanna plug in the power and the USB and things should light up. There's a ton of buttons on this thing, but it's actually pretty simple. The big buttons down here, switch the input that you wanna see. These are the audio controls for each input. We have the microphone controls, picture in picture buttons, the key controls, transition controls, and the transition type. So let's take a look at setting up a traditional gaming stream. Just somebody playing a video game with their camera, probably down in the corner. Plug in your face camera to input one and your console to input two. If I hit picture in picture, I can put my face cam down in the corner and you can put all of your super high quality HDMI sources into one device in OBS. This makes things super simple. You can even load a standby graphic as a still in the software controls. And you can pretty much run your whole stream just from the ATEM Mini. There are a ton of controls on the ATEM Mini itself, but you actually have a ton more options in the software. That's where you can load graphics and get a little bit more detailed with your controls. You can also do some really advanced audio mixing, apply filters, set all of your options. Let's take a look at doing something a little bit more complex. Say we wanna stream a four camera tabletop game. We'll connect our wide camera and our top down camera. Then we'll have two different face cams, angle one and angle two. We can put those all together. You can also connect two microphones. So we could have me and my buddy Dancho here each wear a headset and we can mix all of the audio in the ATEM software and the ATEM will just show up in OBS sounding and looking beautiful. So there you go. There's a short rundown of the ATEM Mini and how I'm gonna be using it for live streaming in the future. Overall, the ATEM Mini is a super simple, affordable way to get multiple HDMI inputs into pretty much any computer with a USB 3. Pretty sick. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments below. If you like this, hit like, and for more videos on post-production, DaVinci Resolve, live streaming, all of those kind of things, make sure to subscribe to my channel here on YouTube. My name again is Casey Ferris, and we'll catch you next time.